In this video, I'm going to talk about how to keep your chats organized within Microsoft Teams and make sure that the most important information for the most important people is always at your fingertips. So I'm back in Microsoft Teams and I'm on my chat window. Um, I'm on the chat icon here on the left hand rail and you can see I've been doing a bunch of chatting and I've got a bunch of people here in my recent chat lists and the most recent person I've chatted with is Nestor and everyone else has kind of gone back in time. Now, let's pretend that Megan is one of my most important collaborators, but I just haven't chatted with her in a little bit. And so I wanna make sure I always have Megan's messages up at the top of my list. You can pin chats within Teams. So if I wanted to make sure Megan's chats are always near the top of my list, I would click on the ellipsis and I would choose pin. Now, no matter what happens in my recent list, I will always have Megan up here in my pinned list so I know that all of her messages will be near the top of my list. And let's also pretend that Christy, Christy here is also important, so I'll pin her up there as well. And let's say this group chat here between Diego, Megan, and Patty and myself is also very important. So now I've got these three pinned chats that will stay in my pinned area while my recent chats will continue to behave the same with the most recent on top. One more tip I'd like to give you here about group chats. A great way to keep your group chats organized is to give them a name. So right now, when I look at my chat list, I just see that I have a chat going with Diego, Megan, and Patty. But let's say I come over here into the chat section and I've got this pencil here, and let's say I rename this. How about Megan and Patty and I are or Megan and, and Patty and Diego and I are working on an HR project. So I'm going to call this chat HR project. I'm going to save that. Now, over here in my chat list, notice that that chat's name has changed. So now I know when new messages come into that chat that they have to do with the HR project. Whereas previously I just had three names there, I might have had to waste time thinking about what those might be about. This way, my time is better spent and I know what, these, what the topic of these incoming messages is.